Good afternoon. This is a tutorial over lesson 28 out of the Berkeley Music Theory Book One. Today, we're going to be talking about the ascending melodic minor scale. Yay. This scale is unique. Okay. This is the scale that transforms. It is goes one way going up and the other way going down. Okay. So there are different notes going up and going down. Okay. So let's talk a little bit about this. The pattern for a natural minor scale, whole half, whole, whole, half, whole, whole. We learned a couple of lessons ago. Then we learned about the harmonic minor scale last time. Now we're going to have another pattern, and that will be whole half, whole, 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 whole half, okay? Four whole steps in a row, okay? This scale is still a minor scale, okay? I, I might have mentioned this in an early video, but what you really need to know is that it's the first five notes that say, hey, this is a minor scale. Okay, that's a minor scale. If it's, that should already ID as a major scale to you. Minor, major, okay? Then the next two notes, okay, are the one that defines which flavor it is, okay? Now we said in an earlier video that there are three flavors of minor scales. It all depends on that sixth scale degree and that seventh scale degree. So we have natural minor first. Okay, that was natural minor, okay? Then we changed one note and made it harmonic minor. by adding a leading tone. And then today, we're gonna to talk about a melodic minor scale going up, okay? And there's actually three ways of thinking about it. I don't care how you get to the right answer as long as you get to the what? To the right answer, okay? So the three ways of thinking about it are from the three scales we already know, coincidentally. The natural minor, you're going to raise the sixth degree and raise the seventh degree. Uh, usually I put an arrow by the six and an arrow by the seven, okay? Uh, an arrow going up. This time I used a sharp, which is slightly confusing, but look at it both ways. And if you raise both the sixth and the uh, seventh scale degree, here's your natural minor scale. So we're gonna raise A flat to A and B flat to B, and you come up with That arrives you at the ascending melodic minor scale. Now the harmonic minor scale, you just change one note of it, okay? And that would be, you're gonna sharp the six, I'm sorry, raise the six, I like to say it that way. That was harmonic minor, by the way. Here's melodic. Okay, so you just raise the six and you get there. Now, those two, great, those two ways are perfectly great. Here's the third way. This is actually the way I think about it. Uh, you're gonna take your major scale, for instance, C major. And all you're gonna do is lower the third to make it what? To make it minor, right? Okay, I just played got you there three different ways. Pick your favorite one, okay? I like major uh, lowered three because it is has the fewest steps to construct it, okay? All right, this has been Dr. Morse teaching you about the ascending melodic minor scale. Bye.